హలో ఐ ఆమ్ డాక్టర్ పింజల రామకృష్ణ వ్యాస్కులర్ సర్జన్ ఎట్ అపోల హాస్పిటల్ జూబ్లీ హిల్స్ టుడే విల్ టాక్ అబౌట్ పెరిఫరల్ ఆర్టీరియల్ డిసీజ్ పెరిఫరల్ ఆర్టీరియల్ డిసీజ్ ఇట్ రిజల్ట్స్ ఇన్ లెగ్ పెయిన్ క్లారికేషన్ రెస్ట్ పెయిన్ అల్సరేషన్స్ ఇన్ ది యాంకిల్ ఆఫ్ ది పిలో ది యాంకిల్ ఇన్ ది ఫుట్ అండ్ టోస్ ఎ వెరీ పెయిన్ఫుల్ ఎ ఇండికేట్ దట్ ది డిక్రీజ్ బ్లడ్ సప్లై టు ది లెగ్స్ పెరిఫరల్ ఆర్టీరియల్ డిసీజ్ ఇస్ సెకండరీ టు మెనీ రిస్క్ ఫ్యాక్టర్స్ సచ్ యాజ్ హెవీ స్మోకింగ్ డయాబెటీస్ hyper tension and uh, excess cholesterol in circulating blood all of these things increase the risk of peripheral arterial disease peripheral arterial disease is known as atherosclerosis it produces cholesterol deposits in the wall due to th- and then result in thickening of the wall which causes narrowing of the blood vessel diminishes the blood supply per minute we expect 300 to 500 ml of blood supply to the leg in any given patient when it decreases to 200 150 ml per minute the people start getting the pains known as claudication so lifestyle modification is essential if the patients can follow the lifestyles a good lifestyle we can avoid peripheral arterial disease and we can have legs for life good circulation good walking habits and that results in good and healthy quality of life to the person this is also to be kept in mind that heavy smokers should stop smoking and take the help of a specialist if needed to stop smoking diabetes people should have good control of diabetes decrease the hba1c to 7 below 7 they should target all the time and the people with hypertension should also take bp medication reduce the salt intake and maintain the blood pressure around 120 by 80 as and when possible 130 by 80 otherwise they should target and those patients who are having abnormal cholesterol level they should also maintain good cholesterol levels decrease the excessive oil intake and food you know, to choose the right food for the right patient is very important if the patients follow all these precautions and reduce the risk factors they can simply modify the progression of the peripheral arterial disease and avoid amputations either toe amputation or ankle amputation or the below knee amputations can be avoided by good healthy habits and staying away from the smoking, controlling diabetes, controlling hypertension, controlling cholesterol in the circulating blood. Thank you.